Here are some useful tips for surviving the chaos server. Let's go! First, using the right pet. For mounts, it is highly recommended to get the highest speed as you'll get involved in a lot of running. Prioritize using the best speed mount you've got other than using the cool ones. Premium mounts have the highest speed possible. For flying mounts, it is highly recommended to focus on getting the high speed than getting the high flight speed. The speed is the movement speed you can travel while in the air. Flight speed is the trust that you create to lift you through the air. For companions, it is highly recommended to fight with the high damage dealer companions. That includes Asian Alligator, T-Rex, Dark T-Rex, and the Purple Wing Dragon. For PvP, it is also useful to get pets with buffs. Hornbull King, Zani Harabit, Giant Ape. Getting massive tanker pets can also help by blocking arrows from the enemies. Second, becoming an archer. Using bow may really be hard for the first timers and beginners. The key for using the bow is the crosshair. By effectively maximizing your sight, you can raise your accuracy or, or even never miss a hit. The crosshair turns red when it's locked on the enemy. When you see a red crosshair, that's the best time to release the arrow. Advanced firing won't work, so don't act like you're a really pro shooter. Remember that the arrows will only hit when the crosshair is red. Even when riding land mount and shards, make sure to get the red crosshair and shoot. Using bow while flying may really be hard for you. Arrows can be blocked by facilities, walls, ores, trees, and vehicles. The red crosshair also triggers with all targetable objects. Third one, gear up. It is highly recommended to use the highest gear possible. You can enhance your gear using the enchant stones in the enchant altar. Watch my ultimate enchant stone guide to learn more. Fourth one, to gear drop. When fighting, it is recommended to only carry one weapon at a time. If you die with multiple weapons or armors, there will be a high chance of dropping them. Equipped weapons and armors won't be dropped. Wearing low durability armors or weapons will higher the chance of them being dropped. Fifth, one usage. This eye is supposed to effectively impair enemies. Remember all element symbols. You can also summon monsters to block arrows from the enemies. Sixth, heart defense. In the future, there might be some heart raiders, thieves, and a lot more trying to steal and conquer your heart. Editing and saving your heart will definitely kick everyone out of your heart. Gliding allows you to use SOS and get out of the area as soon as possible. 